discussion. The Conference of Presidents decided to award the 2010 Sakharov Prize for the freedom of thought to Mr. Guillermo Farinas. The European Parliament paid tribute to the Cuban dissident Guillermo Farinas. The psychologist and journalist has undertaken 23 hunger strikes to denounce the dictatorship of Fidel Castro. He subscribes to the principle of non-violent means to change the world. Mr. Farinas shows that uh, uh, he will do everything and even put his life in danger for what he believes in. And we have to support this. Two other finalists were up for the prize. The Israeli NGO Breaking the Silence, which strives to let people know the reality of Israeli occupation through the eyes of Tzahal soldiers. Breaking the Silence by telling what they have experienced as young soldiers in, uh, in Hebron or where they have been. It's outrageous what they, that, what they have been doing themselves. The third finalist was Ethiopian Birtukan Mideksa. The former judge is the leader of the opposition. She has just been released after spending two years in jail for her political stances. There are women who are raised today to defend the democracy and the rights of the man. De temps en temps, à côté d'un Cubain, leur donner une palme, ce ne serait pas plus mal. Guillermo Farinas is the third Cuban to win the Sakharov Prize in eight years. Whether he will be able to come to the European Parliament in December is still unknown.